President Trump asked for and received the resignation of his Department of Homeland Security Secretary Kirsten Nielsen. CBS4's Natalie Brand is at the White House with details on what prompted the move. Kirsten Nielsen is out as secretary for the Department of Homeland Security. A senior U.S. official tells CBS it's part of a massive overhaul of DHS that's being engineered and directed by Stephen Miller, one of the president's advisors and a hardliner on immigration. We want to go in a tougher direction. Nielsen will be remembered as the defender of the president's zero tolerance policy, which prosecuted anyone caught illegally crossing the border, leading to family separations. President Trump visited the border last Friday with Secretary Nielsen by his side, and he hinted changes could be coming. We want to have everything just perfecto. We'll see what happens. But we may be going, we may be going in a different, you'll be seeing very soon, we may be going in a different direction. And Nielsen's departure comes during a surge of migrants at the U.S.-Mexico border, many of them families and children. As the numbers rose, so did the president's frustration. The president is understandably frustrated with the increasing numbers, but fire Nielsen isn't going to change that. In February alone, more than 76,000 people were arrested or turned away at the southern border. That amounts to nearly two people a minute. Our country's full. We're full. Our system's full. Our country is full. Can't come in. Our country is full. Customs and Border Protection Commissioner Kevin McAleenan now takes over as the acting head of DHS. He joins four others currently in an acting capacity in the Trump administration. Natalie Brand, CBS News, the White House. Nielsen is now the 12th cabinet member to leave the Trump team during his time in office.